I'm Matt Templeton with the Templeton Real Estate Group. Today, I wanna to talk to you about prices and what's happening in the market in quarter four of 2022. Now, before I get to that, I wanna direct your attention to two links. One, if you're looking to find out what your home is worth, click to get our free home value report. Or if you're interested in finding out every home for sale on the market and what the pictures and descriptions look like for every single one of those homes, click the link to see all of our homes on our website. Now back to our topic, what are prices doing in the fourth quarter of 2022? And I have an amazing update for you. Uh, the high point for prices this year was in May of 2022. We saw that uh, prices across the country peaked. And in June, as interest rates started to increase, those prices started to come down. Same thing with July. And the average that we saw across the counties we work was about 9% that prices have dropped into August. But I, I just saw the data yesterday for August, September, and October. I saw it for October, but I've seen it now three months in a row that the data is that uh, the prices have been flat now for, uh, for two and a half, three months. And that's great news for you. It means that with the in increase in interest rates, demand dropped off, and now demand has re-met supply in order to create a flat, uh, stable price level. So we're seeing that prices are not dropping as significantly as they were at first. We saw a 9% drop. So let's say, for example, you were looking at a $550,000 house. Now you're seeing that house at 500,000, which is, is really nice for a lot of our clients to, to have a little bit of reprieve on that. And the best thing for, for buyers is that they're not having to compete as, as aggressively. We're seeing sellers contribute to closing costs, especially buying down rates. We're seeing, uh, them paying for title co uh, coverage again. We're seeing home warranties and we're seeing negotiations on repairs it's back to a more balanced market where buyers don't have to feel harangued by the the way that negotiations go it's a great time to buy with the way that we're negotiating uh interest rate uh, credits from sellers we're also able to get a lot of our interest rates lower than the the market interest rate so if you're thinking about buying it's actually a great time to buy prices are down there's way less competition and we can work through the interest rate uh, increases together as long as we're strategic and uh, that that balance of prices has meant that we've stabilized and we've cooled down now many people ask me well Matt if demand has gone away or demand continues to go down because of interest rates what are because of interest rates increasing what uh, what is causing prices to stabilize and here is what's causing prices to stabilize whenever prices come down sellers have a choice of whether they will meet the buyer at that price and say yes i will sell at that price as well and many sellers are saying i'll just stay in my house if uh, if i can't get a higher price or if i can't find another house to buy and so many people are choosing to stay in their homes um, that's perfectly fine if you don't need to sell stay where you are but that lack of supply is keeping uh, with a lower in demand a little bit lower demand than we had earlier this year that's keeping prices stable so we don't expect prices to to plummet in fact right now we're still if we look october to october 2022 to 2021 we're still up four to ten percent depending on which counties or which areas we're looking at zip codes um and we expect that next year we may still be up another three to four percent um right now for the last three months we've been flat and it's caused a good nice uh stabilization buyers are feeling a little bit it's a little bit easier to get a home sellers that need to sell uh, are still getting great prices because their price is still higher than it was in 2021 but it's maybe not as quiet quite as high as it was in in May and sellers that are reasonable and and offering um, fair a fair price are selling still pretty quickly so if you're looking to buy we've got some strategies to help you beat the interest rate issues and uh, and get a great deal on a house and if you're looking to sell we've got some strategies to help you still sell for a reasonably high price and uh and get a buyer quickly rather than waiting and sitting on the market with no buyers so call us if there's anything we can do to help you buy sell or invest my name is matt templeton with the templeton real estate group giving you a quarter four market update mm -hmm.